Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Sister Luba, go ahead. Uh, uh, Sheikh, I have two questions. Yeah. Um, one is, if someone's son or daughter is having a haram relationship and keep on denying it, and the person is lying about it, what should parents do about it? Like, they are, are they still responsible? Okay, go ahead, push. For his college and other features? Sister Luba, may Allah uh, guide your entire family and uh, please your heart with your kids. Uh, once one's child reached the age of puberty, as long as I am as a parent, did my homework since his or her childhood, I brought them up correctly, I taught them what is right and what is wrong, the right belief, then when they grow up, I don't have any control over them. Am I blameworthy for their misdoing? No, you're not. But it doesn't mean that I would say, enjoy it, do as you wish. I will constantly advise them. You know, I would even advise that they should listen to this clip of you crying while asking this question. Maybe it will shake their hearts. Maybe they will realize that it is very painful for the parents to see any of their children going astray. I know how the youth nowadays think but maybe you never know and subhanallah um, in, in, in the case of many parents who have some issues with their children who one day were good then as you know that things change and the hearts flip over they change they were even into drugs you know and subhanallah I said, when they asked me, shall we kick them out? I said, no, do not kick them out. Especially you're living in the States. You need to keep an eye on them. You need to comfort them. You need to befriend them. And lots of dua. Allah, in this case, because as you know that in the States, you don't have any control over your kids. Any control whatsoever. So the family kept on making dua and begging Allah in their prayers. And Allah accepted their dua and rightly guided their children back. Alhamdulillah wa shukrillah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide them. Ameen, ameen. And may Allah guide all our kids. You know how valuable is this dua, brothers and sisters? Please in your sujood keep saying, Rabbana hab lana min azwajina wa dhurriyatina qurrata a'yunin waj'anna lil muttaqeena imama.